This video is on representation theory. In the previous video we saw uh, the, the concept of sub-representations and now I would like to show some uh, analogies or comparisons between groups, vector groups and representations, especially as far as um, notation and language is concerned. Okay, so representations. You can check the previous video for that. In a way, you are sending groups to the general linear group on vector spaces. Okay, so so groups, they might have subgroups, right? So in terms of groups, uh, you can have a subgroup, but in vector spaces you have a subspace. Okay, in representations, please check the previous video, we introduced this concept, we have G invariant subspace. So we have subspaces that are invariants for the, uh, the group G. Okay. Okay, groups can be simple groups. Uh, simple groups are groups where the only normal uh, subgroups are the, um, the, the, the group itself and the trivial uh, subgroups. Vector spaces. Um, in terms of vector spaces, where we have one dimensional subspace. And in terms of representations, we have irreducible representations and this is going to be my next concept. In terms of groups we have the direct product and vector spaces same concept, same, same, same wording, of course it's not exactly the same and um, we say direct sum in terms of vector spaces, in groups we say direct product and in representations we also use the term direct sum and more or less the same concept as vector spaces. Okay, in terms of groups we say isomorphism, in vector spaces we also have isomorphisms, but in representations we have equivalence. So we, we, we there is a video for equivalent uh, representations. Okay, so next video we are going to introduce this concept of uh, irreducible representation.